Good morning, everybody. So I want to share with you an experience that I had yesterday. I invested in myself to be involved in a business building mastermind with Life Solutions, the company that I do all my coaching training with, uh, Mary Morrissey's company. And yesterday was an interesting day for me. I had had some experiences up until yesterday of a paradigm that had really kind of gotten a hold of me. And the power of this mastermind is was incredible. And so what was coming up for me was uh, a, a pattern belief about myself that was impeding or impacting a behavior that I wanted to implement. And so the belief was that nobody wants to hear what I have to say. Now, where does that belief come from? You know, I know because I've done a lot of work. Is it really important to know that? Not necessarily. But it came from a place of being invisible when I was younger, being in the corner, so to speak. I grew up in a family where one of my siblings was um, always in trouble. And so if you've been in a family similar to that, then you know there's always a kid who gets left out who doesn't get attention. And that was me. Or at least not a lot. You know, of course, I got some attention. Not a sob story here. Um, but anyway, so there there was still some part of me that was in agreement with that belief that nobody wanted to hear what I had to say. And, and I got to experience not only the power of the mastermind, but the power of coaching yesterday. And so one of the things that um, I'm just amazing, magnificent women that are in this group and facilitated by one of the best people you'll ever know in your life, Pam Sterling. And one of the things that she helped me do was to shine the light of awareness on it. It's simply not true. And most of our pattern thoughts and thinking, and particularly the ones that don't support us or serve us, are just simply not true. And so we we shine the light of awareness on that. And to be held in that kind of support for me was incredible and amazing. And I say that because I have historically been a person who doesn't reach out for help very much. Maybe you're like that as well. I, it's an opportunity, a continual opportunity of something for me to work on in my life is to allow myself to be a receiver and to be supported. I'm a great supporter. I'm a great giver, but sometimes I'm not always great on the the end of receiving. And so it's a continual piece of work and evolution for me in my journey here. And as a result of that receiving yesterday and just allowing myself to be vulnerable and authentic, I was given the gift of just a powerful, powerful moment in coaching. And it just reinforced for me the, the tremendous invaluable gifts in coaching. And not only did I get to receive it, I got to give it yesterday, which is my delight and joy and why I'm here on this planet, is to be in the inner sanctum and the sacred space of three magnificent, beautiful light beings and to hold that energy and space for them and to shine the light of truth in their lives. And it's imperative to have this kind of support because that pull of our old thinking is so strong that without that kind of support, we just go back to living the same life that we've always lived. It's not uh, personal to any one of us. It's just a pattern way of being. And so I wanted to share that with you this morning because support is so important And maybe for me, it's even more important because I live most of my life isolated, not allowing myself to be supported. I spend a lot of time in my own head and, and to reach out and allow myself to be supported is really an incredible gift to me. And I did that because I invested in myself with, with programs, many, many coaching programs. And I just encourage you to reach out for support, reach out, allow someone to hold that space for you. You know, we are so close I love this saying of Matt Boggs. He says, when we can't see the picture because we're in the frame, right? This is our life right here. We're in the frame of it. We can't see it. So to have somebody who can have that five foot or 10 foot view for us is, is invaluable. So I would invite you to consider that today for yourself. Where can you find support? Where can you reach out? Where can you invest in your life and your development? That one moment literally has changed my life and today is a brand new baby day. So go out, enjoy it, love it, live it, and have a fantastic day.